Hi, my name is Jen and I am AMP's music therapist. Um, I want to tell you a little bit about what music therapy is and how my skills are being used within the context of AMP. General definition of music therapy um, from the American Music Therapy Association is, and I will read it for you so that I get it correct, um, is that music therapy is the clinical and evidence-based use of music interventions to accomplish individualized goals within a therapeutic relationship by a credentialed professional who's completed an approved music therapy program. So if you wanna learn more about that, you can go to um, the American Music Therapy Association's website, which is musictherapy.org. Um, I am a board certified music therapist. I studied at Lesley University and it was a two-year master's degree, and I am certified by the Certification Board of Music Therapists, and that's on a five-year cycle. So uh, my music therapy is current, and I am currently in practice, and I have been uh, in practice for music therapy for about 20 years, which sometimes feels like a long time, and sometimes it feels like I just started. Um, before I went back to school for music therapy, I had an undergraduate in music and was working in early intervention. I realized that I was doing more work with the kids I was working with um, when we took our little breaks and we would make music together and I'd never even heard of music therapy. So it, it was my mother who said, why don't you check this out? And I was very lucky that one of the top schools in the country was right in Boston and um, I was able to go study there. And I, um, as an intern, worked with every population. I was with, in geriatrics, I was with um, adults with developmental delays. I was with little kids. I was with just regular old classrooms, a lot like some of the things that I do over with AMP. Um, and in this case, I'm using my toolkit that I use within my therapeutic practice now to reach educational goals with um, my kids over in the Springfield schools. So um, when I'm working with AMP, I am working mostly on communication and adaptive instrument playing, and we uh, try really hard to troubleshoot. We want to make the music accessible to everyone in the class. Um, and sometimes I work with occupational therapists, physical therapists. If we have a kid who's kind of wiggly, we'll figure out, do they need one of those little seats that you can sit on to stabilize? Or even sometimes kids will sit in a container where they can feel the pressure. And that's something maybe the OT will suggest for us. Um, and it's just a wild ride of trying to figure out how to get each one of these kiddos to be engaged in their music class. Um, and you have to be willing to try things that sound silly. I've taken um, hair ties right out of my hair and wrapped them around a kid's hand um, because they had low muscle tone and couldn't hold a drumstick. And so there are all sorts of adaptive instruments, but we also are working right on the fly. And um, sometimes it's just a matter of having a few extra sets of hands to model for um, people who may be helping out in the classroom. Maybe we're in the music class and the classroom teacher is there and um, isn't sure how to be the most helpful to the music teacher. So we'll work together and um, help everyone figure out how they can help the kids to best ac access the music. Um, so it's a shift for me to not be working on the therapeutic goals, but I have fallen in love with these classrooms and um, these kids who will climb into my lap to say hello. And, you know, then we start working on other things like what kind of space we need to keep in the class. But I am so lucky to have found this crew and to be able to go in and do this, it's really, it's some pretty great work. And these are some pretty great kids. Thanks so much for taking the time to learn a little bit more about music therapy. I'll put some links in um, the notes for this video and um, 
And if anyone is ever interested in looking into music therapy as a career, you can always reach me through AMP. Um, and, you know, I hope you find a way to use music for yourself right now. You know, sing a song in the kitchen. Take care.